what's up guys today I'm going to be showing you this free intro maker editing <clears throat> backgrounder app that's extremely nice and extremely good to use and basically you can make any sort of intro or anything you want so to start off we're just going to start with pressing clip maker and I'll be showing you guys how to use it so when you guys start off you'll see this like blank thing you can pick any one of these templates. For this one, let's go with more let's press more creations, right? Oh, there's tons of these. Let's go with you know, for this let's go with um All right, and we're gonna. Well, okay. You know what? Let's just pick um. Hmm. Let's go with template. Just. things like this and then there's other templates you know what we're gonna make let's we're gonna press on this one <clears throat> and then how to use it is you start by pressing this cube there's all these different things in the pre in the pre ones and then there's all these shapes And this is one of the more confusing ones because there is multiple, there's two templates. For template, let's just make Fortnite, right? And we're just going to press Fortnite and we're going to. Fortnite. I'll do Fortnite right there. Basically, we're gonna we're gonna reset it. And now we're gonna. I'm gonna be sorry for any background noise. And then we're gonna keep looking. All right here, and you're gonna wanna, and boom. If we reset it, I'm just gonna mute it for now. And boom, we just made a Fortnite intro. For frame length, for this, we'll just go with nine, <clears throat> right? And let's play. And the great thing about this is you get this super cool looking intro or clip with all these sick looking edits. Frame rate, if we do 60, we could do 4K if we wanted to. I'd just do 4K. See how good that looks? And this is for basic settings. And setting it to this makes it look extremely good. And I just wanted to show you guys. And you could change anything else you want. I'm not gonna. There's anti aliasing there's everything here. Check the 3D. You can add any music that you want. This is built in music. This is where you would download it. You would press start video render. I, I like to keep it as um, WebM and set this to good quality. And then 
you get a really good looking set. And basically that's how you use this. That's the basics. If you want to make your own, you just, you'd go to projects, you'd create a new project, or you'd go straight to this and then just add text, whatever you want. And yeah, that's how to use this. If we do a new project, right, we have this, right? Background, outdoor, let's go sunset. Look at this. Now we have the sunset. We can add text. And basically, boom, MJ plays like that. We can fix, let's go with that. Detail, we're going to go high. Thickness, we're going to go, actually, that's way too high. 11 seems fine. And then color, let's do like this kind of. Actually, I think an orangish, and basically, yeah, as simple as this. And then, if we add like particles, right? Size, like particles. I'm going to change it to like this. Clump blurry, right? There's a ring, there's... There's circle soft, right? Look at that. Let's add some shake. Slow the shake speed. Boom, look, we can. Now if we go back to this, shape, box, if we go to box, And basically, you can make a border around it and, you know, have it shake or whatever. And th that's the simples to using Pantoid. You know, look at this. We, we made this. And I've made some other things. So, yeah. Bye. Just make sure to subscribe. See you in the next one.